What's up guys, we're back with more Smallville, we're on Season 5, Episode 3, this one's called Hidden. So guys, I cannot wait to check out this next episode. Yeah, it was really crazy, man, that last episode, because Lex Luthor was trying to basically catch uh, uh, Clark in the act of using his powers, because he's still trying to figure out if he has powers or not. You know, we did see that Clark was really pissed at him, and he just punched him or whatever, so they're not friends anymore i mean i don't think they're really friends at all like or they're just kind of like they see each other here and there and they'll probably speak to each other but they're not clark hasn't trusted lex in a while in a long time um uh, but we're gonna see what's gonna happen from this point from these two because uh yeah because you know yeah lex with you set up a trap or whatever to get this like serum or whatever that the guy wanted that you know held uh, clark's parents hostage this was basically all part of the plan from uh lex luther and he was you know uh yeah, Clark was just super pissed, uh, rightfully so. And we did see that Lana and uh, Clark got together at the end of the episode, even though I know it's not going to last long. I know because we already know who's going to end up with. We already know he's going to end up with uh, Lois. So it's gonna, it's just a matter of time when it's going to end. So that's pretty much what I'm waiting for at this point. But it was pretty cool to see Chloe uh, work the, you know, working with Clark. Uh, and it's cool that, of course, she knows his, you know, knows his powers and stuff like that. So it just makes it a lot easier. Another thing is, I hope we get to see Pete one of these days. I don't know if we'll ever see him again because, I mean, when did he leave? Like season three ish. Uh, so hopefully we'll see him one, you know, one of these days. But yeah, anyway, guys, Patreon sponsor for today is from Daniel. Uh, Daniel, thank you for your wonderful support for this month. I really appreciate it, guys. Make sure you just go on the page and consider joining. I appreciate any support that does come around. Anyway, guys, let's get into this next episode for Smallville. You're out of your mind. Hold on. Wouldn't expect you to understand. Oh, no. On three. One, two. Don't do it. Don't do it. Three. What's going on? I'm sorry. So killed him. No idea. Just the necessities would take so long to pack. Listen to me, Chloe. Pretty soon it's all going to be over. I know it sucks to say goodbye, but if Smallville managed without their cyber wizard, I'm sure that they'll survive without their star reporter. Chloe, you're the one person who will understand why I had to do it. I have to make people realize it wasn't my choice. It's the only way. Gabriel, what are you talking about? Gabriel. How much time did I spend at the torch helping you chase the big story? Have you ever seen him before? Get it. What happens in an hour? Smallville is finally going to be gone forever. It's like a bomb? Nuclear bomb or something like that? Or... It's the best night's sleep I've had in weeks. It took freaking five seasons. Oh, God. Oh, my God. How do we feel asleep? I told you we should have gone to the town. Jeez, but I'm sorry. What do you do at 2 o'clock in the morning? Hey, look, you're not mad, are you? I'm furious. Oh my god! Come on. I thought I never would see the day, to be honest. Oh! Mark, what the. Mr. and Mrs. Kent. I can explain. Clark and I made this decision together, so we're not mad. It, um, but this is, uh, you're both in new territory. He's shocked. He's like, what? Early morning or late night? What the hell are you doing here? I've been admiring your sketches. Going through my things to get better acquainted. You can't just come in here like this. Lana, I didn't mean to rattle you. There, were, there was no answer, so I started to get concerned. Aren't you the person who told me I was hallucinating last time I mentioned a spaceship? Lana, I might have appeared skeptical, but I still believed in you. Whatever caused that crater was not immediate. Hello? Gabriel, hi. I, uh, I need your help. I started to leave town like you said, but then I was really freaked out when I was driving, and then this dog ran out on the road, and I... Chloe, slow down. What happened? I, I guess I must have overcorrected, and, and I ran my car into a ditch. And I can't get it started now. I'm really scared. Can you help me? Where are you? Uh, Route 87, near the old mill. <laughs> Tell me what the symbols mean. You're in there. 
Man, he is been gone. obsessively drawing these for weeks. They're identical to the markings on the ship. Gabriel, I'm sorry. Everything happened so fast, I didn't know who else to call. It's all right. You can come back with me. You'll be safe there. Gabriel! Which silos did you activate? I trusted you. Whatever your reasons for doing this, killing everyone's not the answer. You're wrong, Clark. It's the only answer. Oh my god, did he get his powers back? Yeah. One of the gunshots found on Route 87. Male, 18 gunshot wounds in the chest. Oh, got massive bleeding, vitals are unstable. We need to intubate now. Clark could die out there. In 20 minutes, none of it will matter, Chloe. You can kill everyone in Smallville. Wes. How could you do that? It's not that difficult. The failsafes were programmed back in 1979. It only takes a moderate genius to bypass them. You don't watch your dad do the same drill for 10 years and not pick up a thing or two. You're getting what you always wanted. The story of a lifetime. You actually think I care about that right now? You should care. The last meteor shower left 10 times as much rock to infect people than the last one. Pretty soon there's going to be more psychos running around this town. So that's his answer to nuke everyone? Bomb everyone? It's my one chance to be a hero. There's people running around trying to save the day. All those times I pulled away. It's because I knew this day would come. What? You're not supposed to be in here. Please, you need to clear the room. Just die for ain't no way. Maybe he's getting his powers back. Wait, Lionel went back to normal. Wait, how did he become so strong? Expecting that. Oh, I'm not looking forward to seeing Jonathan and Martha's reaction. Oh, no. Sir, Mrs. Kent, we did everything we could, but we lost him. I don't even know what to say. Doctor, we have a problem with the Kent boy. What's going on? Oh, he's alive. Two minutes to launch. He's got... Did he get his powers back? Where's he at? So for Fortress of Solitude? Oh, come out. How do you know to call me that? You're my son. Jarrell in his body? Jarrell? And I hope the time is coming when you will call me father. That's just the hospital. How did how did you get me here? The portal in the cave. And this body was activated by the crystal it became a an oracle of kryptonian knowledge rectification does not come without a price what's the price the life of someone close to you will be exchanged for yours i would never ask for that you already did when you decided to relinquish your powers and disobey me 
It was your choice. Then just don't bring me back. It's too late. Always know that I love you. So messed up, though. lost our son. Look, if I had any idea what happened, I wouldn't have to call the police now, would I? Adams, and send her over there. I have to call you back. Right, son, they told us you were dead. Who is he going to take away, though, Jarrell? was. Jarrell. He returned your powers, didn't he? All well, of his test results came back normal. Are you gonna realize, Lex, that he is just like the rest of us? You don't believe that crap. It's like, what? Do you really believe that? Or is that what you have to tell yourself to stay in a relationship with him? You've had your doubts about him, too. You can't deny it. A normal person doesn't rise from the dead. Right, you gotta, I mean, you gotta question that, because it's weird. So maybe now you can tell me why you've, uh, you've been wandering around mumbling things like Krypton, Kal-El. Krypton, Kal-El. I don't... The last thing I remember is standing here arguing with you. You don't recognize these? Looks like something from the cave. What is it? I found you carving them with a corkscrew. <laughs> Wasn't I creative? <laughs> I wish that I could unlock the labyrinth of my subconscious. I'm sorry to disappoint you, son. I think I'd say this is cause for celebration. Lex ain't giving up. He's gonna try to find the answer, man. I really liked being the only one who knew all about, you know, you. For lack of a cheesier word, it just made it special. You honestly believe that you can stay with Lana and not tell her? I think you're seriously kidding yourself. I 100% agree. I don't have a choice. I can't expect her to react like you did. Well, um, then you're going to be a, do all that breakup stuff again. I've risked too much already. And now someone else is going to have to pay for it. Oh, yeah, because of what Jarrell said. That's why he's feeling that way. I never should have given up my powers. Boy, I think I've made a terrible mistake. Man, I wonder who has to uh, pay for you know, Clark's powers or whatever, you know, to pay for, for, with their life or whatever. That's, that's stupid though. I'm like, when I'm looking, when I'm thinking about it, I'm like, man, like the screwed up choices that Jarrell gives uh, Clark for certain things and the way they're, with the way everything is, is just dumb. I'm just like, oh my God, like just terrible choices. Of course, I don't understand everything about Krypton. I'm not going to act like I understand everything. This is just free me from the surface of what I'm seeing. I'm just like, what? I mean, you know, Clark has to pay for something. Basically, so, you know, someone else's life, you know, has to probably get swiped away because, you know, Jarrell gave his powers back. Why? I, I don't understand that, to be honest. Like, someone needs to explain that to me. Like, what am I missing? I don't understand the culture of how he runs things, how he thinks. It's just, it's weird. It really is. So, yeah, Clark did make a terrible mistake because now that's over his head. And the reason why he doesn't want to still tell Lana, he probably did is that you know she he, he doesn't want her dying for him from Jarrell or whatever how what whatever's gonna happen i don't know who's gonna die but it's gonna be someone close to him i don't know who it's gonna be it could be one of his parents could be jonathan martha was alive through the time so i don't think it's her it'll, it'll definitely not be martha so i could count her out so it could be jonathan it could be chloe or lana one of those three well and if pete's not in the picture so i doubt it's gonna be pete 
you know, so I'll count him out as well. But this is going to be really, really interesting to see, see, you know, how where, where this is going to take us, to be honest. So I got to see, man. It was cool how, of course, uh, Clark stopped the, you know, the bomb. It was, you know, the animation at the time looked pretty cool. You know, him going into space and stopping everything uh, and, you know, throwing the bomb into space or whatever. And then they, he saved Smallville. And then, uh, you know, Gabriel or whatever his name is, the tech guy, uh, pretty much wants to kill everyone it's just like i don't think i rem i don't remember him i don't know if we've seen him before but I, I can't remember him to be honest and then you know with jarell taking over lino's body so basically of course he could go into lino's body anytime and you know take over and basically he could be able to talk to uh clark or whatever and you know of course lex luther is going to still continue on trying to uh figure out uh clark's secret because he, he he's not stupid he knows uh, clark has a secret he wants to find out exactly who he is what kind if he has powers or not so he he wants to find that out so he's not going to give up at all and of course Lon, you know lana was trying to defend uh clark but lana had those questions too she can't act like she didn't so yeah i'm really looking forward to seeing this next episode guys hope you guys enjoy the reaction uh, please leave a like and a comment on the video make sure you go on the patreon page to get the full reaction and also consider supporting the channel as well but anyway guys hope you guys have a wonderful day i'll see you guys next small bill